Hey everyone. Um, so I was tagged by Lisa of Happy to Hook Creations to do the holiday 2018 tag. Please excuse me. I am sick. <laughs> I have been dealing with sickness for the past four days, five days. I don't know. I don't even know. Um, started with the kids, moved on. But anyways, so if I cough or I sound <clears throat> funny, that's why. So let's get started. Um, so question number one is when do you start decorating for Christmas? Um, it kind of just depends. Sometimes it's, if I'm feeling very festive, it will be like the day after Thanksgiving. Or like this year I've been dealing with sickness and stuff like that. So we still have not really decorated. We've put up like um, a few things outside, but we're still not done. Like we haven't even put up our main Christmas lights on the house. It's just like a few things in the yard. So it really just depends on when I feel like it. Um, what style do you decorate in? Um, typically it's very, um, green and red, but this year I kind of wanted to go more like, um, vintage slash lodgy kind of feel. So they're not bright reds and greens and white. It's more like the muted, more, um, faded reds and greens with a lot of wood or like rustic things like pine cones and pine tree needles and you know very rustic kind of feel slash vintagey colors if that makes any sense um what's your favorite christmas tradition with family oh well when so the tradition that I've had most of my life until we moved away from family was every Christmas Eve, we would all go to my grandma's house and we would have like Christmas lunch together, whether it was a ham or like sandwiches, it didn't matter. Like, but we had the whole spread. We had um, like cookies and pies and everybody brought something and we all opened each other's gifts. So my sister's family, my grandma and grandpa, my dad, everybody would get together. We would all open each other's gifts from each other. And then we would go home. And then the next day on Christmas, we would open up gifts for just our family. So like the presents that my dad would give me or, you know, or my stepbrother or my stepmom or whatever. Like that was when we opened everything else. And it is definitely a tradition that I am missing, but we've kind of made a way to work it. So we end up Skyping now on Christmas Eve and we still open presents together. Um, favorite place to buy Christmas decor? Anywhere. Anywhere that is um, somewhere I can afford. <laughs> um, so a lot of the times it ends up being like Walmart, Target, um, or I make them or Dollar Tree, pretty much anywhere that if I can find something cute and I can afford it, then I buy it from there. So, um, number five, favorite Christmas movie. Ooh, this is hard. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to think of like the one movie that I like, okay, it's Christmas time. Let's watch it. So... For me, I would have to say A Christmas Story. I think it's that one. Is it A Christmas Story? No, Christmas Carol. But the one that I remember growing up was the one with, oh gosh, what's his name? Murray. Oh, his last name's Murray. And it used to scare the bejesus out of me when the ghosts came. But that was like my favorite movie. And it still is today. Um, Bill Murray. That's the one. Um, six, eggnog, hot cocoa, or apple cider? Uh, <laughs> so pumpkin eggnog, love it. I've already bought like three quarts of it since it's come out in stores. <laughs> um, 
I like hot cocoa after like being outside for a long time and apple cider pretty much just anytime. I love apple cider. So favorite, I don't have one because I like all of them. <laughs> Do you leave out cookies for Santa? If so, what kind? Yes, we leave cookies out for Santa. And it kind of all depends on what I end up making. Some years it's chocolate chip. I've made some with sugar cookies. We've also left out carrots for the reindeers. We've also done peppermint sticks. So it pretty much just depends on the year. Real or artificial tree? So this is the ongoing (laughs) debate with my husband is he likes artificial trees. I like real trees. I don't care about the mess. It doesn't feel like Christmas unless I have a tree, a real tree for the smell, the look, everything. Like, I feel like it isn't Christmas until you got some pine sap on your hands from a Christmas tree. Um, so we've come to the conclusion that every other year we do a real tree. So one year, real tree, one year, fake tree and back and forth. But we, uh, (laughs) got rid of our fake tree when we moved here. So it's a real tree this year. (laughs) Um, Favorite holiday dessert? Ooh. Uh, I love pumpkin pie. I really do. But I just made like bread pudding, which I haven't had in years. And it has cinnamon in it. And now it's like, because this is the first time I've had it in years, I'm probably going to now. That's like going to be my go-to Christmas dessert, bread pudding. Yes. Delicious. Oh, okay. Um, favorite Christmas cookie. I would used to love sugar cookies. Like those are my favorite, but I'm very much a chocolate chip type of person now. I love chocolate chip cookies or molasses cookies, which I just learned to make that this year. Um, from a small, like, it was like a small bakery that my mom used to take us to. And I remember the smell of those cookies. And one year it was so weird because I smelled that out of nowhere. Like this smell of like molasses and like all, not all spice, like, um, clove and ginger and cinnamon and nutmeg. And it just like, it brought me back. And I like asked my sister if she had the recipe and she asked my aunt, my aunt had it. So those um, molasses cookies, too. I'd have to say chocolate chip and molasses are now my favorite. Um, favorite. Oh, no. Wait. I already did that. Do you open gifts on Christmas Eve? Yes, we do. Um, but only from my other family, not immediate family. <laughs> like my grandma, my grandpa, my dad, my sister. That's the only gifts we open on Christmas Eve. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> Do you decorate your Christmas tree yourself? Most of the time, my husband helps with the lights. And then I get help from Emma, who loves to put on um, the ornaments. And I have to be careful because my, because Colin is still so young. I can't put on the nice ornaments, like the novelty type ones, because most of them are made out of glass or ceramic. So I can't put those up yet until he gets a little older. So I have like a whole stockpile worth of ornaments that I've been hoarding that I have not been able to put on trees because of having young kids. So they've all been like that anti shatter plastic ones. So that's what we decorate. (laughs) Where do you spend your Christmas day? At home with family, in my house. That's where I spend Christmas day. Most of the time we wake up way too early. open Christmas gifts. I make breakfast or me and my husband both make breakfast since he is the meat man. So he makes the bacon and the sausage and then Christmas dinner later on. And that's pretty much it. So number 14, favorite Christmas smell, cinnamon pine cones. You can walk into any craft store right now and pick up one of those bags of cinnamon pine cones. That 
and pine, like from a Christmas tree. Those two smells go hand in hand, and that is Christmas to me. Um, so 15, what is your favorite thing to craft or make during the holidays? <sighs> well, I love baking. I love baking. It's so much fun. But I hate cleaning up. So I like baking. But that's not like crafty to me. That's that's baking. Um, crafting, I would probably say a blanket or something for my kids. So whether that's a toy or whatever, probably a blanket though. I just started a scrap scrap blanket because I have like, here, let me show you. I have this thing woo, full of uh, scrap yarn. So I need to do something with it. So I've started a scrap blanket and that is what I'll be working on Christmas or maybe a Christmas cast on of something. I don't know. I'm not sure yet. I wanted to do Christmas socks, but that's probably not going to happen this year, unfortunately. So that is it for the Christmas tag for the Christmas traditions. Um, let's see. I tag Lacey um, of the Hooked on Owls podcast. I will also tag... Oh my gosh, I'm totally blanking. And everyone that I can think of right now has already been tagged. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay, so Lacey, I tag you. And anybody else who has not been tagged or just want to participate, I tag you. You can do it. Um, sorry it took so long because I know she's put this out the end of November. Took a while, but I've been sick and dealing with sick kids. So I hope you guys like this and I'll see you guys later. Bye.